Mariaman, thank you for uh, accepting this interview. Uh, you are now in Qatar. Um, and I want to start to ask you what motivated you to book for the program of Unconscious Mind Coaching? And I uh, saw your profile and what you did, and there was a great energy that I felt from you. Um, I felt that uh, it was the right thing for me to do. Um, it was uh, something that came quite naturally to me. Yeah. Great. And I felt like it was the right step. Okay, great. What was happening in your life? What was that issue that you wanted to resolve? Or what were those changes you wanted to make before we worked together? I think that I had um, become quite um, complacent, you know, and comfortable uh, in my life and developed certain patterns that I was sensing were uh, causing some issues for me uh, in terms of personal growth and moving on to another stage in my life. Um, and I think uh, it was quite a pain after talking to you as well. Some of these were linked to, you know, my past experiences. And um, I felt that you know, there were a lot of things going on in my life at the moment. I was being made redundant. Um, I had to figure out what the next, you know, sort of how to jump to the next stage of my life and make a success out of it. And I felt like I needed a bit of a push. How would you describe the experience of working with me? What are your thoughts on your experience with hypnosis, with these NLP practices and this stuff um, we went through during the, the, the program? I think that um, the whole NLP thing and the hypnosis thing was uh, very interesting. And I think it was very effective in uh, making me kind of stop and really reevaluate certain things and go a lot deeper um, into my subconscious about, you know, things that uh, were basically obstacles for me. Um, I think uh, that um, is a very good way to, um, you know, sort of reevaluate things and untangle or not that is in in yourself because uh, sometimes you know you get caught up in this very fast-paced life with so much input and distraction that we don't take out time to do these things for ourselves and um it's important to kind of times reach out to someone who can help you start slow down and help you with um untangling you know these sort of not an issues um yeah for you okay so, maria mm -hmm. how do you think that um or, or how crucial do you think it was the work we did together hypnosis and this unconscious mind coaching in the way you approach that next step in your life, that transition from being made redundant to finding the right thing to do um, and to, to manage that uncertainty that you had in your life at that moment? Um, I think um, when a person has uncertainty in their life and a lot of change going on, uh, what helps them is really, um, I think, looking for some reassurances, you know, uh, or to be just, um, uh, to have better awareness of um, their own strengths and, you know, areas that they need to improve, work on. And what would you say to people that probably are watching this interview and are looking into making changes in life, into achieving certain goals? into feeling the way they really want to feel what would you be what would it be your message for them i would say um don't be afraid to um, go back <clears throat> into uh your own self and your own um experience in the past it may feel uncomfortable at first or the idea of it may be comfortable but the process of doing that will only result in some positive for yourself um it's important for you uh, if you want growth uh, 
that you reevaluate not just uh, your successes, but you know your failures and things that have always been great in order for you to move forward and to grow as a person. So yeah, I would say um, take that jump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jump, jump, jump. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, Maria. Thanks very much for sharing your experience and for being with me in this interview. Thank you.